Hello dear all welcome to Sunday Education Academy I am Santosh Wag In this video we will see question number 1 of exercise 12.2 chapter exponents and power so let's start our video See question number 1 of exercise 12.2 chapter exponents and powers See question is given express the following numbers in standard form and these are the sub questions We know what is standard form standard form I will write here see standard form in standard form now see what is standard form here for standard standard form let's say example 1.4 into 10 raised to 4 see this is the standard form means there is only one digit to the left only one digit to the left of the decimal point and all the digits remaining digits are expressed in 10 raised to 4 Ten raised to something means here. See this example. It is zero point zero 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 zero. There are so many zeros, so it is very difficult to write this figure. So if we convert this figure in standard form, means if we multiply and write ten raised to something, then it is very easy to write that figure are you getting so in standard form we are moving we are moving this decimal point are you getting we are moving this decimal point and keeping only one digit left side we are keeping only one digit left to this decimal point but what about this remaining digits these are converted in terms of 10 raised to some power this power is positive are you getting this power is positive means there will be zeros after this decimal points if we remove this 10 to 4 then there will be zeros and now here what is our aim we have to remove we have to replace this decimal point this to this place means there must be only One digit, not zero, or numerical number one to nine. So to move this digit from this left to right, if we move this, move decimal point. If we move decimal point left to right, left to right. Then there is ten raised to minus. Now how much digits we are moving? We will write here ten raised to suppose minus four. Means we are moving this decimal point from left to right four digits. If we move decimal point from see see there from left to right, then it is my negative ten raised to negative number. and if we move decimal point from right to left from this point to this from right to left then then we convert it as 10 to positive then th there is positive number so for example 4 now see this examples here there are how many zeros 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 There are eleven zeros, but we have to move this decimal point up to only one digit will be there before this decimal point. Means we have to move this decimal point, this point. Mean how many digits we have to move? This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10 11 and 12 means we have to move this decimal point 12 digits so how we can write 8 point means we have moved this decimal point how many digits 12 so write either 10 raised to minus 12 because we have moved this decimal point from this left to right left to right left to right so it must be minus and how many digits we have moved 
we have moved moved 12 digits so 10 is to minus 12 it is very simple if we are moving this decimal point from left to right then 10 is to will be minus number now see the next example here also we require to move this decimal point from left to right and we have to move up to this 9 so let's count this is the first second third fourth fifth six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve again we have to move this decimal point 12 digits so what will be our answer in standard form 9.46 into 10 raised to minus 12 again minus because we are moving this decimal point from left to right that's why it is minus now see the next example here the decimal point is at the end there is no decimal point means decimal point is at the end this is the meaning of this decimal point if there is no decimal point decimal point is at the end now we have to move this decimal point up to this because in standard form we are keeping only one digit left to the decimal point so our answer will be 6 point and this remaining 6.02 remaining are 0 so it is not necessary to write 0 only we will write here 6.02 but we must multiply 10 raised to now see here we are moving decimal point from left from right to left and let's count how many digits is first second third fourth fifth sixth seventh eight nine ten eleven twelve 13 14 and 15 means we have to move this decimal point 15 digits so right here 10 is to 15 and sign will be plus because we are moving this decimal point from right to left when decimal point is moved from left to right then there is negative sign 10 is to negative power and when decimal point is moved from right to left there is positive power so our answer is 6.02 into 10 is to power 50 plus 50 similarly see the next example in this example again we have to move this decimal point from left to right left to right so what will be the answer we will keep only single digit to the left of this decimal point means our answer will be 8.37 into 10 raised to main thing is what will be the digit to the power and what will be sign positive or negative now see here we are moving this decimal point from left to right when we are moving from left to right it is always minus yes it is always minus and how many digits we are moving count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 are you getting means we are moving 9 digits so right here 9 i think this would be clear for you after decimal point to the left before decimal point there is single digit in the standard form and see into multiplication is 10 raised to some power that power is positive or negative it depends what is the condition of the moment of this decimal point so if we move the decimal point from left to right then this power is negative and that number depends how many digits it is moved very clear now see the last example see here there is no decimal point means decimal point is at the end now in standard form put only single digit left to the decimal point means 3.186 and remaining zero need not to write into 10 raised to 
see here decimal point is moved from right to left so this power must be positive and count the number of digits how the decimal point is moved count this 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 means we are moving this decimal point 10 digits so 10 places are moved so right here 10 and sign is plus because it is moved from right to left so in this way we have studied how to express these numbers in standard form now see these are the usual forms and these are the standard forms when the usual form numbers are very small then it is always preferable to write these numbers in standard form this is all for this video we will meet again in our next video do learn do enjoy thank you